What I really love about Jason, what I find unique about Jason, is they take you through everything. I love that they link the scientists, and it's not just one type of scientist, it's all types, female, male, different ethnicities, different backgrounds. And I love how they link it to what we're doing in class. It gives the students relevance. It gives the students knowledge about different careers other than just cosmetology and mechanics or building houses. Teachers, you know, they're so swamped trying to do grades and lesson plans. Jason makes it really easy because the scientists are already, I mean, they're there. They're, they're able to get into contact with, so you don't have to spend a lot of time looking for people that fit into that particular unit. Jason has already done that part for us. And I think the feedback that they get from these, you know, prestigious scientists really is amazing because they're going to become interested in whatever it is that they're studying because they feel like they're part of it. What I love about Jason is that it's online. So one, it's easier for me to look at instead of having to look at past worksheets from other teachers. Uh, but also that it's just really authentic. It's definitely 21st century. It's so organized. Like I love that I can now go and look at specific units. I can pull bits and pieces out. I love the videos. I love how it's called missions, which for me, if I'm 13, I feel special. I'm going on a mission. So it's really engaging for not just the middle school, but K through 12. It starts off with that engage piece and it gives kids the opportunity to explore. And during that period of engage and explore, you know, their minds are working like little gears and they start thinking about things. What if, how can I, how could this be done? So it starts that whole process and lends to creativity and curiosity. It has certainly changed the mindset uh, of the whole community. I have teachers who are coming from other content areas to ask me, do we fit into this Jason learning? I'm not a science teacher, I teach social studies, but do I fit in? And I try to explain to them how you can integrate geography um, in our Jason components or how you can use Jason components in your geography lesson or in your social studies lesson. And they get amazed. And this is something that uh, I strongly believe in, that teaching cannot be uh, or learning cannot happen in isolation. Uh, it has to be integrated. It's an opportunity for your GT children as well as your advanced children, as well as your bilingual children, your special ed children, all to be on the same playing field because the opportunity is there for them to grow. Considering the population that I work with, you know, they get really excited when they look at a video and they see, oh, there's someone that looks like me. This air, and they are doing this research. We've had students go through the program, one in particular, Freddie, six years ago. He went to the Aegean Sea, came back, and he is now in college. First person in his family to go to college. His sister wants to be an Argonaut because she sat in the auditorium as a second grader, watched him on the live broadcast. So it, it changed Freddie, it changed his sister, and it's really changing the whole family and their friends around them as well. Anytime a person has an opportunity to step away from a textbook and to step outside of the traditional classroom and to experience something firsthand, especially when you have the opportunity to do it with a scientist or an expert or the creator of that thing, um, I just, I don't, I don't know. I think it's, it's breathtaking. If I'm getting this excited about something, I know that I can take this back home and I can pump those students up to be this excited about science.